fellow survivors, Wanderer here. Welcome back to Fallout 4 Frost. So, we're just exiting out of the Boston Mayoral Shelter. Got some water. So, mission accomplished there. I'm gonna head down now to Mass Pike and pick up some food. Make sure we're set as far as ammo and stuff goes. And then we're going to be heading over to Vault 95 to clear that out. I stopped by there, but I didn't have the water to really feel comfortable going through it. Oh yeah, this is the same place we are at before. Already checked that. We are going to be heading down there and clear it out for some experience. Of course, you know, one of the big goals right now is to get some more levels. Uh, we're 83 right now. We have 11 perk points to spend, but those are going to go really quick. But we're... We're going to go right through those because we need to bump up our Endurance all the way to max. I want to pick up probably Rod Resistant, Adamantium Skeleton, Lead Belly, um, Solar Powered, Ghoulish. Like, we're going to max all of these. Probably also going to max Strong Back, um, you know, Heavy Gunner for um, more carry weight mainly. There's a whole bunch of stuff we need to get, so... I'm going to be basically trying to get as high of a level as I possibly can to give us the best chance that we can have of surviving the island. So, I'm going to run down here. I might skip ahead a little bit uh, until I get down to um, Vault 95, so I will likely see you down there. Alright guys, we're just about there. This is the uh, Robotics Pioneer Park, where I guess you... Learn about robotics. And death claws, apparently, too. So. Oh, yeah, um, hi. Um, I'm kind of stuck here. That was fun. I kind of wish this wasn't a um, assault rifle, but at least I have the high ground here, which means I can very easily hit these guys with those headshots. Yeah, I thought there was a death claw over here. Yeah, yeah, you thirsty bastard, Nate. Have some water. Uh, I guess I'll release these guys so I can kill them. Sweet. I think you're supposed to use these guys to um, kill them, to kill the Death Claw. Oh, Jesus, that actually kind of hurt. That was maybe a bit overconfident of me. I kind of lost a lot of health there pretty quickly. New Why is that not hitting? You know what? Um, Will be restored shortly. Take some nades there, fellas. That did like nothing. There we go. Well, the experience is worth it, but yeah, holy crap, that was actually a bit scary. Gotta remember, you know, like, I'm not... My character's strong. Like, it's about as strong as you can get. But... There are still, most certainly, limits. You know? We're not immortal. Nowhere near it. It would be uh, good to remember that, maybe. Good to remember that now before I fight something stronger, you know? Yeah, I got the assault rifle out for last time. It's not that great, you know, like I'm not gonna lie, it's not that great of a weapon. Oh yeah, this is a salvage place. Normally a super mutants, it should be ghouls now, I guess. But there still should be lots of good stuff laying around here. Okay, that's a grenade! Lulz. Uh, 
What was that? Oh, it's one of these guys. And another one of those guys. Yeah, this thing's not that amazing, but, like, I have a lot of ammo for it. And I, like, I don't care if I use it all, so... That's kind of nice. I can just spam through my ammo and not really care about it too much. I did stop by and get some uh, Deathclaw meat. So we've got plenty of that. And plenty of water. Oh. Okay, that should be it. There's not a whole lot of stuff here. And again, I'm not really looking for loot so much as I am experience. Got it. There isn't really a vendor for a very, very long way. So... Not too much point in, like, getting anything but, you know, money or extremely valuable stuff I can sell for a lot, mostly ammo. Ammo, food, and water, and chems, pretty much it. And even then, like, I've got so much money, I don't really care. Okay, it should be good. Um, so yeah, we're almost there. A couple places down here I forgot about. Someone mentioned going up to the um, the Bean Town Brewery. I've already cleared that, unfortunately, for alcohol. My brewing buddy, though, um, he's up north. Did use quite a bit of fusion core sprinting around to get down here. Um, I don't believe there's a fusion core in Vault 95. Maybe there is. I don't remember. I thought about getting another fusion core, but I didn't realize how fast I'd drained mine coming down here. That other core did go pretty quick. Should be okay, though. Just can't be too crazy with our... Our AP use and stuff. Let me go ahead and bind this stuff real quick. So we got Deathclaw Stakes. That goes on... Uh, here. I do have, like, nuclear physics and stuff maxed out, right? Yeah, we're already maxed out on that. That's cool. Just looking at that perk for a second. They really, really buffed it a lot in uh, 76. Made it kind of overpowered. Well, no, you know what? It's, it's not Nerd Rage. It's uh, Emergency Protocols. It's so overpowered. So when you're below 20% health, you have 50% additional DR. That's the really overpowered one. So you use that in combination with Nerd Rage. You get extra damage and a whole bunch of other stuff. Which, I'm, you know, it'd be powerful here too. It's just, uh... I've died quite a few times while using that perk in, uh... On Fallout 76. Not sure. Not sure I'd trust myself to use it here, you know? I think probably not. So yeah, we'll go through here and clear out some gunners. Um, make sure I've got a grenade. Yep, we do. Get some experience, clear out some gunners. I'm probably going to use some very mentats here. Uh, just so I know when they are coming. And so I can... There they are. Get some, motherfucker! <laughs> Take 
think you can hide? Playing bullshit. games with me, this huh? Bullshit. This is bullshit. Come out and fight! Is it bullshit? No need to hide. Here. <laughs> All the other souls. <laughs> ah! I think it's bullshit, guys. What the hell is this? It's like a strobe light in here. What the hell is that? Ooh. Boots. You're here. So many conflicting signals here. Where is this damn radio? Shut up, radio. Is it this? No, nah, it's not that. Okay, this guy is over here. There's a lot of dead people here. Don't, uh, don't shock me, bro. Just grabbing the stuff real quick. Just a bunch of random dead survivors. Looks like it. The jet will make you jittery. Okay. Forget the story behind this place, but uh, lots of dead people. Not a happy vault, this one. What the? I swear I must be going crazy. What? What? Look here wall you only extend to like right here but i shot like right here and you still block me that's some stupid bullshit so sick of these walls they have really really poorly implemented um hitboxes really bugs me Vault Tech Doctor's dead. He had a stealth boy. Should have maybe used that stealth boy, Doctor. It's kind of funny, but like... If I were a survivor, I'd be storing my purified water and stuff in these. Nice. Such a common item right now, you know, but... In the nuclear apocalypse... It's pretty cool looking. I ain't gonna lie. I'm tempted. Come on. No. Dang it. I'm like going blind here. There we go. Eh. Not that cool of a place for a screenshot. Too dark. You guys have no idea how much a pain in the bite is to find good spots for screenshots. It takes hours sometimes. A really good one in a really good, um, really good screenshot in a really good thumbnail can absolutely double how many views a video gets though. 
So unfortunately, it's what you gotta do. I do, like, I do enjoy it. It's nice, it's satisfying making something like that, but I enjoy playing the game more. Was that all? I thought there was more in here than that. I mean, I guess we did kind of run through it pretty quick. Get everybody pretty fast. There's there's upper rooms up here, I think. They haven't touched yet. Definitely looking for some more booze, though. To offset. Uh, the kills we did here. Um, it's only four things, I guess, so Through. has to be one of those. We get four guesses, right? So oh. bit trippy. Okay, this is one of those areas that Frost uh, breaks the precombines on and looks a bit funky. There's a mod called Jacques Frost that fixes those, but it has a whole bunch of other changes that I don't really want. So, unfortunately, um, I don't use it. One of my one of my friends um, in the dis Discord, uh, Flunder, has used it, and he actually removed the parts that were not like that affected gameplay and stuff. You know, that were not just like fixes. Um, something like that would be great to remove those those issues, those errors. Cause yeah, I like the fixes a lot. But I'm not a huge fan of all the gameplay changes. There is some stuff that'd be okay. Um, like I would, I'd like to have more standardized um, receivers. This is gonna be fun. Oh. Fine, keep your shit. But um. You know, it's not a huge deal. Damage is like so high in Frost that it kind of doesn't matter that much. But yeah, like in my opinion, there's really no reason to not make, um, oh, you do have stuff on you. Wait, that's in there. Okay. To not make, um, your automatic receivers do just as much damage per shot as your regular receivers. Um, you know, personally. Or if you could use the clean room. This is where you take uh, Kate to get her clean. Which, why you couldn't just shove an addict doll into her arm. I guess it doesn't work on her because she's used too many chems now. That was her story or something. I don't remember. But, um... It's a small thing. It's not a huge deal. Make sure we got the loot down here. I didn't really loot in here. Just shot people and left because there were a whole bunch of people to kill. And then we'll be on our way. Mainly looking for booze and ammo. Kind of funny, but yeah. Drugs and ammo and water. 
and booze. Mostly booze, though. I got everything else in spades right now. And yeah, a Brax is really good, too. It can make um, more men tats with that. I have to go and slam a whole bunch of men tats until my dehydration is, like, extremely high. But our sanity is all the way maxed out. And then uh, using a dick doll and drink a whole bunch of water. It'll be all set. So that's that. Oh, there's some more stuff over here. Oh yeah, there are lots of grenades here. Mini grenade traps. These are all good experience. And this just... That's just totally bugged. Okay. I guess we won't go over there. What the fuck was that? Hey. You are so dead. You are so dead. Nah. Nah, I don't think so. Didn't want that gas can. I just wanted the money. Oh well, it's fine. This would be an okay base. There's like pretty much everything here, I think. Along with quite a few bottles. If you started in this, this area of the world, um, and you could actually get through killing these guys... You know, the main thing, like, the, the main, like, barrier to entry in Frost is just, like, getting a good weapon, you know, and some ammo for it. Like, that's, that's what you need to do to succeed. Once you've got that, like, I haven't taken a single shot here so gotcha. far. It really hasn't been a big deal. All these cups, no thanks. These guys were trying to get sober by drinking lots of coffee, I guess. It was like an AA meeting. Always have lots of coffee at the AA meetings, you know? Or at least that's how they're depicted in... Uh, in movies and stuff. Not really much of a drinker IRL myself because I'm rather antisocial and drinking alone just is not appealing. <gasps> Lots of bottles. I should come here first before I went to um other spot, but I needed I needed um oh yeah, here we go. Antibiotics too nice. So many beers. Okay. Well, this was Cut a great shit. place to stop by. Sir. You need to stop. Okay, you need to just stop. You can't punch someone in power armor. God damn, two stim packs. Ooh, buddy. Just gonna take all this stuff and I'll drop the extra crap later. This was like a... This place was... This was a pretty twisted experiment place. Like, they just... They gave these guys lots and lots and lots of chems. Then watched them get addicted. And then... I don't know. Like, I forget the true story of this place. But it was pretty insidious. It was pretty terrible. Gave them all the chems and booze they could ever use, and then they had to get clean. It's like they were studying the effects of it, of uh, alcohol and drug abuse on them. The fuck is okay then? That's all right. Hmm, okay. That's that precombine's broken. I wonder what's breaking these precombines. 
so horribly. I don't think frost does too much in here. Like it might, it might block a terminal or something uh, to make sure that Man, you can't. You the wrong fight. I don't know. Ah! I'm surprised they got that one. Ooh, big guns bobblehead. Shut up, Travis. You don't exist yet. Stop breaking my immersion. There is a mod to fix that, but I, like I said, I'm I'm like 99% sure it's it doesn't work um, with the latest version of oops, with the latest version of whatever. I totally just blew something up. Didn't mean to. I think this is all this is all pre-war stuff. Or it's all pre-frost stuff. Uh, it doesn't none of it's relevant really to frost. More bottles. Yeah, I'm just gonna take all the bottles. Then we'll have even more because we're gonna go and uh, gonna drink all the booze, and then we'll have even more bottles that we can use. Okay, I think that's all over here. Yeah, this was a great little place to go to get a whole bunch of booze. I didn't realize there was so much in here. I think I go here like every Frost playthrough. Sweet. And then for some reason I just forget about it. Completely forget there's so much... Oh. You were, head you were headless and then you weren't. Interesting. One of the devs on Fallout 4 was obsessed with putting things that you couldn't get. Oh, you can get this. Okay, well that one you can, I guess. I'll pick it up just because. Maybe there was something in that one. There was not. Yeah, one of the devs is obsessed with doing that. with uh, putting stuff underneath of trash cans that you can't move, although that trash can you could move. The other one you could not over in uh, Super Duper Mart. It's just stuck forever. It's teddy bear locked in there. Very sad. I think Wilson gets him out. Which is kind of cheating, but it is what it is. It's a teddy bear, who cares? It's like one leather. Um, I think we're done. At least in residential area here. It's a bit confusing. Hard to be sure that we're actually done, but yeah, I think we're actually done here. Okay, let's get out of here. Um, I gotta think about where I can go to get a fusion core. I mean, I could go back and get one, I suppose. I'm just lazy. I'd rather not. Would rather just pick one up on the way. I mean, I certainly don't want to be out of my power armor, you know? Okay, I'm a bit lost, actually. Um... Do we go over here? Um... There we go. No, it's not that way. Oh. It says one way. Here we go. Thanks for the directions. That apparently was it. Thanks for the directions there, sign. What a nice dev to put that there for us. Telling us there was only one way to go there. Might have missed this. Yes, I did. Oh, God. Ugh. Stupid freaking sandbags. They always scare the shit out of me. Every time. But yeah, I, th I think that's it. Do we go through the overseer's place?
could cook some stuff up here real quick too. Do I have a bunch of food to make? Yeah, I got a bit. Can take a quick break to cook some food. Rather than cooking it out in the open. Just sit on top of that can. There you go. Good job. Alright, um... Yeah, might as well make some purified water, I guess. Fungal moonshine. Uh, yeah, why not? Remove some rads. It gives you some hit points. It's pretty good for you. i make one, though. Okay, let's make a whole bunch of stuff here. Unless, um... Yeah, I can make some depth claw. Some mystery meat. Some more mystery meat. That's actually all okay. That freaking light flashing. The fuck was that? Why am I? Really? I guess cooking something made me. I guess we're hungry, too. Oh, it's, because, it's probably because I lost my buff from uh, some venison. Okay. Still a guy here? Yeah, still a guy here. You were so dead. I don't know. They always gotta fight back. Must be on top somewhere. Haven't explored somewhere up there. I was through here yet. Not enough dead bodies. Let's do this, metal man. The hell did he go? I don't know where the heck he is. Well, unless you got like a fat man. Not too scared. All your buddies had lots of drugs, but no guns, unfortunately, so... It's too bad for them. Probably not a good way to go in the wasteland. Anything special here I can do? This overseer's terminal? Uh, no. I've done this hundreds of times. I think you can open one of the doors with that, but... Already opened it, so no point. Okay, so I already went over there. I already went over here. Got all this stuff. That's residential. I've been over there, so... So where the hell is this guy at? I'm very confused where the hell he is. I mean, he's over this way. Is he down, like, through here? No, he's too far away now. I thought maybe he was on top of the stairs here somewhere. You know what, dude? I don't know where you are, and I don't, I don't care. I guess you get to live because I am too lazy to find you. So, uh, enjoy your life. Let's go. Yeah, that was an absolute ton of bottles. Okay, now we start making our way east. A lot of ground to cover, a lot of places to explore in this kind of lower southern marshy type area. A lot of places I want to check out that might have some good experience and good loot, potentially. 
So let's see here. Switch back to our regular map. Uh, yeah, so I'm just going to kind of look around over here. Which, uh, if I don't see a fusion core by the time I get to like 50%, I'll have to go back up and get another one. So we'll just have to hope that we see one. And if not, not a huge deal, I guess. We'll go and get another one. This is promising, though. Oh, yeah, doesn't a sentry bot spawn over here? Yeah, he does. Okay, well, there's our fusion core taken care of. Um, that's a big boy. We're gonna drop a mine or two here. Oh, shit, shit, oh, fuck. Um, I didn't realize I could do that. Hmm. It was at this moment that Wanderer realized that he had fucked up. So in times like this, my friends, um, hmm, we have explosive shielding. That's good. I thought I had more than that on those uh, mines and I forgot that you can eject your fusion core. So yeah, in times like these, uh, we just use as much, as much as we possibly can. And probably some Ultra Jet too, to buff our health as much as humanly possible. Medex for some more DR. Not gonna lie, guys, this is gonna be pretty bad. Um... We may very well just die. Let's make sure we don't have weakness or anything going. Now we don't. I think that's all the health stuff I can do. About 300 health about the tops you can get. Properly hydrated. Regular buff out won't stack. Do we have any psycho buff? Yeah, there we go. Psycho buff. Let's see. What are we at now? Okay, 360 is pretty good. Because I, I can't... I can't... I can't get out of the power armor, um, because I'll just die instantly from this grenade. And I can't, um, I can't run away fast enough either, most likely. So, all I can do is buff myself to a ridiculous amount, and then hope for the best. And we're going to use Ultra Jet 2. And then we'll use some uh, water... And we'll use some... What else do we have here that can boost our hit points? That would hurt really badly. 131 hit points and minus 107 sanity. Yeah, that would be pretty bad. Um, this will give us some max hit points. Okay. We can do that too. Uh, this gives us agility, AP, perception, max hit points. Okay. Okay. Okay, uh, 400, and then we will use, um, this is so bad. If I die like this, you guys will never, ever forgive me. Right away, stim pack. And then we're tired. Um, okay. Nuka Cherry. There we go. And then some more water, finally, to... Okay. Uh, wish me the best, guys. Okay. I don't know how that didn't kill me. But, um, you know, I'm gonna roll with it. I'm okay with it. Now we have to kill this guy, because he apparently is wake woken up. You gonna come out, my dude? Let's 
supposed to be weak on legs, right? There we go. We got him. Oh, man. Misadventures in accidental fusion core ejection. I have to go in here to release the door on that thing, I believe. Yes. He's not supposed to come alive, I don't think, until you go in here. And then, yeah, as soon as you go in here, he gets released, and then he comes out, and you fight him. That's how it's supposed to work. But because I ejected my fusion core and the explosion hit him, he went hostile. I may have to patch that, because I'm a dum-dum. Well, at least we got some more fusion cores. Oh, I'm a moron sometimes, guys. And now we're carrying way too much. I'm going to see if I can drop some stuff here. I want all the bottles. I don't need a bunch of this stuff, though. A lot of stuff I just picked up because it was in my way when I was trying to pick other stuff up. Okay, that should do. And uh, the missiles, I will just probably drop all of them. Or most of them, and we can just carry them. That's way better. Okay! I hope you guys enjoyed that. Always fun to see me make a big, big, big mistake and almost kill myself, I'm sure. But hey, we got some more missiles. How, how many of these can I take? Hold on. Without being too over-encumbered. A drop like three. Um, two more. Two more. There we go. Oh, there are dogs around here that I can't see, and I'm, I just don't care enough to loot them. I've got plenty of food back at the base. Actually, no, I should get, well, no, nah, it'll be fine. I really can't believe I did that. That was, that was kind of insane, actually. Are you, uh, you not hostile? What? Apparently you are. You are so dead! The weird sculpture over here. This is, um, oh, this is the, the, no, I forget what's over here. There's a, there's a good amount of stuff over here, though. Like, there's a lot of stuff to explore around here, guys. We're, it's not gonna be like, we're not gonna just make a beeline for the, the place and be done. We're gonna take our time and look around a bit, I think. Okay, missile. Let's be real, we're not going to need missiles really anymore. Going to make some room, like maybe three missiles worth. We're not going to need a whole bunch more missiles. We got ten back of the base still. Ah, 
hiding your money in the toilet. For shame, for shame. Silly wolf, you can't bite power armor. At least not in frost, because it's realistic like that. In horizon you could, which is going to eternally bother me. That a wolf can bite through solid steel. But whatever. And hello there, bears. There's a whole bunch of food over here. There's bears, there's, uh... I'm gonna snipe these bad boys. just didn't give a shit. If you're gonna ask why I don't um, use alt to slow my breathing, it's cause it doesn't work in Horizon or in Frost at all. It just doesn't work. It's always one person that goes, oh my god, you idiot. Why don't you use alt to slow your breathing so you can freaking look down the sight straight? It's because it doesn't work in Frost at all. It just doesn't work, period. I'm not a moron, okay? I've got 3,000 plus hours played in this game. I'm not just stupid. It literally just doesn't work at all. Hey, bear. Why'd you come up out of there? What the hell are you doing down there? Bears don't sit on the freaking... Yeah, get up there. Bears do not behave in this way. You're being unimmersive. Oh yeah, bunch of loot over here. Again, you know, we're just not gonna really use this. Just dropping missiles everywhere as I go. That really, like, I can't overstate how much it would have sucked if I had died back there, guys. Like, that would have been so embarrassing. Like, really? I, I died from that? I mean... I mean, I've died from it before. I just completely forgot that, yes, if you don't have enough fusion cores on you, that can happen. Uh, so, uh, yeah. Alright, that's all in this little shack here. So here's some examples of that um, frozen over, iced over um, stuff. The ice and lakes getting frozen looks pretty good, though you can't actually step on it. Don't don't try. You'll just fall through. It's not, it's not a good time. What do we have over here? Wolves, I think. Couldn't really tell. Just a bottle, bandage. Hey, I played my song. I guess the guy, the original guy that made that song, was really upset about them using the song in uh, Fallout because, you know, it's all violent and stuff. And his music company didn't consult him or didn't explain how violent the game was. He had moral objections to it or something. Which, fair enough. The song's about screwing women, you know, it's about wandering around from town to town and getting laid by all the women there, pretty much. Come on, Master Safe, work with me here. You're not gonna have anything good in you anyway. Let's be realistic here. Oh my god, that was tough. Got it. Okay, I I stand corrected. You had some very good stuff in there with, with you, so okay. 
That is a nice shotgun. Um, yeah, it's like a really good shotgun, but shotguns, they're just not that good. Ammo is really heavy. DR is a big, big problem. Forgot that breaks. Got the scary music going. Isn't there like a shotgun or something in here that's gonna shoot me when I open this? We should be fine because we got power armor on, but and plus we got a million drugs going that are gonna boost our health a whole bunch, but still. Yes. Maybe not. Another level, very nice. Syringes are worth quite a bit too. Okay, let's get the uh, eggs here. Fine time for us to get that. There's no enemies around. Get that proc. Oh well. I'm gonna go up here and get the wolf meat. Check out this place up here. I know it's dark, guys, but I mean, I what, what do you want me to do about it? Oh, it was a bunch of deer I shot, I guess. That's good. We need more deer meat. Um, was that all of them? Looks like there's... Yeah, it's all of them, I guess. Just two. Well, there's one more, I thought, but he went, like, flying somewhere. Oh, missiles. I'm just gonna give up on it. I went like a sentry bot that just went flying. Oh well. Or a model robot thing. It'd be hard to make that jump. If only his bed worked, I would just, you know, sleep here for the night. I can see. I was going to make a brighter headlamp too. I think I will do that next time I'm back at the base. Make a brighter headlamp and then we can actually see. Oh my god. I'm going to actually run out of bobby pins eventually here. Which is not the end of the world. I mean, I usually stock up That's over it. at, um, oh, somewhere in. I think it's, uh, I forget her name. The vendor outside with the machine gun turrets outside of uh, the bar. But yeah, guys, I think we're going to end the episode here for now. Um, it's really, really dark. I want to try to find a place to go and sleep for the night. I mean, I guess I could go back to Vault 95. It's a ways away. But I know you guys don't like me adventuring at night because it's really dark. Um, I don't know what we'll do. I could go back to Mass Pike, I guess. I need to drop stuff off anyway. Maybe I'll go back to Mass Pike and then get some more water and stash it. Or something, I don't know. Uh, but anyways, guys, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.